I seen a. I might have been a tweeter. You ran into King Von's kids one time. Oh, true. I love that baby so much. I'm like. Was this in Chicago? Or was yes. This in our area. I am from 39th Street. Mm-hmm. Von's baby mama, brother, used to hang with Brick. They were being team. They were best friends. I grew up together. So Von's baby mama, um, we were out in the park one day. And. I'm just standing there, and this baby just ran up to me. And I looked there, and I remind you, I've never seen pictures of Vine kids. Like I say, I've never, like, I didn't, see, like, know who his kids were or to know. And I say, I'm standing there, and this baby ran up to me. And grabbed the bottom of my, she just grabbed my legs and wrapped herself around my legs. Uh-huh. So I'm looking down at her and I'm like, "Who baby is this, y'all?" You know. And Lily say, "Y'all don't know who Lily is, but y'all got to know who Lily is. That's Lou Myra, y'all." Y'all yeah, need to do our homework. Lily. Oh my God, do your homework on Lou Myra. I'll do Lou, my Lou research. Lou Gang, period. Do your homework on Lou Gang, period. That's why my name Lou Sheen on Facebook. I ain't changed the chat. My real name is Lashina, but I put the Lou in front of it because it's still for Lou Gang. Lunatic Gang. That was mm-hmm. our little clique we used to call ourselves because we used to get Lulu. <laughs> Katie got bands, all us. We was Lulu. You're in the same crew as her. What? Wow. That's crazy. I didn't know that either. You're letting us in on some yeah, f- lore right there. So wait, wait, break that down. So you and Katie got bands? Me, Jim, Katie, Lumira. Like, it's like 12 of us. Gee, we just came together because we just used to get Lulu. Long live <laughs> Drew. Lou Drew, we just made him Lulu. Um, <laughs> man... And this baby grabbed me. So Lumira, like, I say, who baby is this? Now the whole time, Vine's baby mama is standing right there. Right. They know who I am, but I don't remember who they are. I just know they were some little girls from the hood that used to be in the hood when we was in the projects. Not in no block hood. I'm talking about on the low end. So I look down and Lily being funny, and she say, that's Vaughn and Missy, baby. So it was like some in me, y'all, it jerked me. And I looked down, and she smiled at me. And I just was like, y'all, first word I say, y'all fucking shit me. And I'm looking at around. This baby don't know me from a can of paint. And the fact that she ran up to me and grab me and embrace me like that. That was divine and intuition to me that whatever I'm doing, God, God gave me his approval. That's what I believe in my spiritual self because this baby ran up to me. And when she did it, she didn't do it once, she did it twice. So I say this, who baby? So I asked her mom, I say, can I pick her up? And she said, yeah, Sheena, you can pick up. I know you. I'm not with none of that internet stuff. And I'm like, cool. So I'm like, can we take some pictures? She like, yeah. So we actually took three pictures, but I only posted two of them because the other picture had her doing up three. It's like, like she was BD or something. Going up the tray. You are so I didn't want to put that type of narrative out. I didn't even post that picture. I just posted us throwing the peace sign yeah. and me holding her. But when I took the pictures, I didn't post them till three hours later. Mm-hmm. And I made sure I, I have a thousand witnesses. And I say, can I post them? And she say, yeah. She gave me her permission that I can post her daughter. And I say, well, you sure? Because you know how the internet is, baby. They going to be trolling and getting. She say, I ain't with none of that internet stuff, Shana. I know you. As sure as shit stink. I posted it like 12 something at night. Y'all, when I woke up to the next morning, oh, my God. (laughs) 
She didn't let him get to it. She said, can you please just take the pictures now? Oh, really? Wow. And I say, that's why I asked you. But she let a lot of people who didn't know or did know her. She probably was getting that stuff from everywhere. Bitch, you letting them hold, you letting her hold my grandbabies or you letting them like family, like yeah. they didn't like that. Damn. But they can't stop what God is meant to happen. God sent that baby to hug me. You understand what I'm saying, y'all? God sent that baby. So I call it divine intervention. I've been hearing you uh, talk about your spirituality a lot, <laughs> this podcast. It seems like a lot of people in Chicago are converting to Muslim. Are you Christian or Muslim? I am very religious, okay? I'm not Christian because I don't go to church. I don't. Wear dresses to my ankle. I commit every sin probably around besides <laughs> murder. You know what I'm saying? So I, I ain't trying to. But when I'm spiritual with my shit. You know, because them be the most devils in the churches. You know what I'm saying? I'm just, I come from a Baptist from my great-grandmother being an evangelist. So the seed was already planted in me. Mm -hmm. And. If I got to be the pastor of the family, I will. But once I get to the point to where I'm not cursing, I'm not drinking, I'm not smoking, it's a wrap. They better watch out, baby. That anointing's going to be, they already feel it right now. And I, you know, I'm one of the biggest sinners in the world. But like I say, <laughs> I ain't committed to seeing God ain't going to forgive me for I got a few more questions for you before we wrap it up. Uh, so... What's your relationship like with FBG Young and Dutchie right now, currently? Maybe you need to ask them what their relationship with, with me. I love them kids. I mean, you would think out of everybody, they would be the main one checking up on me, calling, you know. You all right, mom? Like, I just recently ran into them at Mikey Dollar's pool party was off the meat rack, might I say. <laughs> but that was the last time I seen them. And we were skiing them. But they say they was going to come to the show, but they was telling everybody else, you know, they come back and tell me, sneak this and shit. I don't know why she put our name on there. Because y'all told me it was okay. But, you know, it's fine. I need everybody to check out NoJumber.com. We officially started a blog. It has in-depth articles about current events, music, etc. Plus all of our content in terms of podcasts, interviews, etc. And you can get some exclusive new merch if you check out NoJumber.com. So make sure you tap in.